the channel. Uh, today we have just popped down to Aldi's to do a little bit of a shop down there. Haven't actually been to Aldi's for a few weeks I guess now. Well actually more like month and a half something like that um yeah so we just popped down to aldi's to do a bit of a shop so if you'd like to see the video of what we got today then keep watching <laughs> Okay then guys, so I'm just going to run you through everything we got in our little, uh, our Aldi shop today. So bear in mind, it is only Chris and I here, oh, although we do have like grandchildren and some of the family pop in. So I have got like the odd few bits here, so like when they come visit, they can have a biscuit or something like that. Um, so yeah, I'll get cracking. So we bought the British Baby Spinach, this one. Um love this this is all all washed and ready to go so we have that with salads or meals and wilted all sorts of things um four bananas I only got four bananas because i'm the only one that eats them chris absolutely hates bananas chestnut mushrooms one of our favorites um broccoli that was in there like super six 39p I was out of washing up liquid. It's something I don't buy very often because if you've got a dishwasher, you kind of like do forget to buy it. So, but obviously there are things that you need to wash up. So yeah, got that one. That's been recommended by um, the Good Housekeeping Institute. There you go. Um, we've got some Glade air freshener there to go into the uh, little spritzy spray thing. Um, kitchen roll, nine toilet rolls, massive great big swede here, that was 39p as well, um, some British carrots, a cucumber, a uh, savoy cabbage, that wasn't in 39p, I can't remember how much it was, but it was a really good price and a really good hearty cabbage as well. Um, tomato, salad tomatoes, mint sauce, lovely strawberry jam, that looks really lovely. And this apparently has got, I can't see where it says it here, but it actually did say it on the sign that it's 55% um, fruit. So that's quite good. Um, some mixed peppers. I bought this to do a really quick bolognese. Um, I have still got some tinned tomatoes. So I might use those, but if ever I need anything quick and easy, perhaps if grandkids come in or something. So I bought that. Uh, tomato and herb pasta sauce. Um, chicken tikka there to do a curry. Gravy. Um, the Malted Bloomer, oh, we love this. Unfortunately, we love it, it's gorgeous. Um, we bought four of the Tiger Rolls, so maybe have a bacon sandwich in the morning or something. Um, I needed some more gravy bones for the dogs. Some British White Onions here. Um, a bit naughty, Chris and I, we actually picked up some chocolate. Chris has chosen the white chocolate and I've got the fruit and nut. Um, bin bags, 40 uh, refuse sacks there. Um, some dark chocolate digestives. My daughter Hannah goes mad if we never have those in. Uh, over here we've got uh, some creamy coleslaw. A pack of two of the Belgian buns here. Um, never used this before, but it was such a bargain. I think it was about two forty nine for um, how much is in here? Let's have a look. Three liters of fabric conditioner, and once again, it has been recommended by the Good Housekeeping Institute. So I thought I'd give that a go. Um, some long grain rice there. Over here we've got crunchy peanut butter, some brown sauce, uh, four cans of baked beans, um, a fruit 
tea low. It's a bit bright here, so I don't really know what the lighting's doing. Um, some butter. That's kind of like Aldi's take on Anchor, really. Um, some stuffing to do a little bit of a roast. Um, some pork pies. Chris does like his pork pies. Some... Um, how much is in here? I think there's 900 grams here of the mature white cheddar. Um, 12 of the British free range eggs. Um, a pack, 18 pack of the family favourites. So in there you've got monster claws, the cheese puffs and the bacon mashes. Um, a great big bag of, 5 kilogram bag here of the... British um, everyday essential potatoes and it says that they're like um, wonky now including wonky potatoes but are all potatoes wonky anyway let's go over here now then so over this side let's put some light on there um, we picked up a double pack here of the um, thick cut bacon, the unsmoked bacon. We've got gammon steaks with honey and mustard butter. Uh, 750 grams of minced beef there. 13 slices of ham, family pack of cooked ham. Um, chicken, ham, hock, leek and chardonnay puff pastry pie. Eight Cumberland sausages. Um, little, a pack of the chicken mini fillets. This is a pack of the four breaded fish fillets. Belly pork, some belly pork here. And um, Chris wanted these, the New Orleans Chicken Wing Company. And they're smoking hot wings. So they're in there, they look nice. Um, we got a pack of the frozen chunky oven chips, honey glazed parsnips, some mixed vegetables. Um, we just got one of these of the uh, the long life semi skimmed milk because Chris doesn't have he doesn't have milk in his coffee or anything like that. So it's just me, and if we buy the other milk, it just goes off. So that's the best thing for us to get um we bought the apple and black currant double strength squash um the everyday essential diet cola and lemonade because it doesn't matter if it's going in with a vodka or gin so yeah that's what we got so i will tell you how much it is so yeah this little shop all together i say little it's plenty here for for us two for a week um and that came to a total of 73 pounds 13 so we thought that was a really good shop didn't we we certainly did so i'll talk to you later then guys and then during the week i will be popping up some um dishes some meals that i've made with some of this shopping haul so talk to you later bye